Hi and welcome to this video summary of the book Rich Dad Poor Dad by Robert Kiyosaki. In this video, we will be taking a closer look at the central idea of the book, the Rich Dad philosophy and the key lessons that it teaches. Before we dive into the content of the book, let's start with a brief overview of the author and the book itself. Robert Kiyosaki is an entrepreneur, investor, and financial educator who has written numerous books on personal finance and investing. Rich Dad Poor Dad is one of his most well-known books, and it has sold millions of copies worldwide. The central idea of the book is that there are two ways of thinking about money and financial success, the traditional way and the alternative way. The traditional way involves getting a good education, working hard, saving money and investing for the future. The alternative way, as taught by the rich dad character, in the book, involves developing financial intelligence, taking control of your financial future and building wealth through multiple streams of income and smart investments. The rich dad philosophy is based on the concept of financial intelligence, which is defined as the ability to understand and manage money. According to the book, financial intelligence consists of four pillars, accounting, investing, market knowledge, and law. The rich dad character in the book embodies the rich dad philosophy. He is a successful entrepreneur and investor who teaches the narrator, Robert, about money, business, and investing. The rich dad is depicted as having a different mindset and attitude towards money than the poor dad, who represents the traditional way of thinking about money. The rich dad philosophy encourages readers to take control of their financial future by developing their financial intelligence, learning about money and investing, and building multiple streams of income. The book Rich Dad Poor Dad teaches a number of valuable lessons about money and financial success. Some of the key lessons include The importance of financial education the book stresses the importance of financial education and encourages readers to learn about money and investing. The rich dad character teaches Robert that the best way to become financially free is to educate yourself about money and investing. The dangers of relying on a traditional job and savings account. The book warns readers about the dangers of relying on a traditional job and savings account for financial security. The rich dad character teaches Robert that the traditional way of thinking about money is flawed and that relying on a job and savings account is not a path to financial freedom. The benefits of developing multiple streams of income The book encourages readers to develop multiple streams of income, such as starting a business, investing in real estate, or investing in stocks. The rich dad character teaches Robert that having multiple streams of income is key to building wealth and achieving financial freedom. The importance of understanding and using debt to your advantage. The book teaches readers about the difference between good debt and bad debt and how to use debt to their advantage. The rich dad character teaches Robert that debt can be a tool for building wealth if used correctly. While Rich Dad Poor Dad has been widely popular and influential, it has also faced a number of criticisms. Some common criticisms of the book include Oversimplification of financial concepts Some critics argue that the book oversimplifies complex financial concepts and fails to provide a balanced and nuanced view of personal finance. Promotion of Risky Financial Strategies some readers have raised concerns about the book's promotion of risky financial strategies, such as investing in real estate without proper research and due diligence. Lack of evidence for the rich dad philosophy. Some critics argue that the book lacks evidence to support the rich dad philosophy and that the ideas presented are based on personal anecdotes and opinions rather than sound financial principles. It's important to approach the book's lessons with caution and to do your own research before making any financial decisions. The book's ideas can be useful and inspiring, but they should not be taken as gospel. It's always a good idea to seek advice 
from a financial professional and to carefully evaluate your own financial goals and circumstances before making any investment decisions. To recap, Rich Dad Poor Dad by Robert Kioski is a book that explores the difference between traditional and alternative ways of thinking about money and financial success. The Rich Dad philosophy, as presented in the book, is based on the concept of financial intelligence and encourages readers to take control of their financial future by developing multiple streams of income and smart investments. The book teaches a number of valuable lessons about money and financial success, but it is not without its criticisms. It's important to approach the book's lessons with caution and to do your own research before making any financial decisions. In conclusion, I'd like to encourage you to further educate yourself on financial matters and to take control of your financial future. Whether or not you agree with the ideas presented in Rich Dad Poor Dad, the book is a good starting point for learning about money and investing. I hope that this video summary has been helpful and that you now have a better understanding of the book and its ideas. Remember, Building wealth and achieving financial freedom is a journey, not a destination. It requires continuous learning and effort. By following the lessons and philosophies presented in Rich Dad Poor Dad, you can develop a more positive and productive mindset about money and gain the knowledge and skills you need to achieve your financial goals. I encourage you to read the book and learn more about Robert Kioski's ideas and philosophies. Remember, the most important thing is to take action and start working towards your financial goals today. Don't wait, start your journey to financial freedom today. So, that concludes our summary of Rich Dad Poor Dad. I hope you found this video helpful and that you have a better understanding of the book's central ideas and philosophies. Thank you for watching and be sure to check out other videos on our channel for more informative and educational content.